What's up guys? I just want to do a quick video. Um I don't know if you all are familiar with um there's this league player, his name is um Donkey or Donkey, however you want to pronounce it. But um I don't watch his videos or anything. Only reason I know about him, um, I watch Sky Williams on YouTube. And uh, my boyfriend put me onto his channel and um a few of the one of the guys that he plays with, his name's Donkey, so um Apparently, a few days ago, he had posted a video saying that he was pretty much quitting League. Um, and the reason why was because um, he he got banned. Um, I don't know how long the ban was for, but he got banned for saying something towards a player. Um, long story short, uh, you know, he, he, was, he was trying to rank up. He's in rank. He was playing ranked. And I, you already know how I express how stressful rank can be, but you know he was getting fed up. He had a guy that was just like feeding. I don't know if it was on purpose or he just I don't know, but um, he ended up saying some pretty nasty shit to him. Um, and uh, shortly after, he gets a message saying that he was banned. Uh, <laughs> Now, he had made a video, you know, explaining everything, what happened, and, you know, how he felt about it. Um, pretty much, this is my opinion on it. Like, I've never been banned. I've never been suspended from league or anything. I'll admit, you know, I've raged at people. I try not to. I do my best. But the point is, you know, that the way this community is set up, like, the internet, the internet any online game can be like negative and toxic but it's the way that riot runs things as far as punishing people that you know make the game unplayable unplayable for people that's what's wrong with the game that's what's wrong with the community um so he gets banned for you know saying something kind of nasty to him um should he have been banned you know i don't know what how many times he was reported for being toxic before that so i can't really say yes or no obviously if you're being that toxic yeah eventually you should be disciplined um but the fact of the matter is that you know you get banned for saying some shit in chat and apparently riot the way they do their 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 um tribu tribunals they'll go ahead and i guess they'll look at chat see what was being said and then they'll decide whether or not they want to go ban a person now the thing that makes this not work is because people can reach a breaking point They're, they may get pissed they may say some shit they normally wouldn't say and then before you know it you're going to get suspended you're going to get banned now meanwhile we have people who are intentionally feeding trolling afk DCing and you got those some of those people that troll they will just sit in base and just go ahead and walk around in base just so they don't get kicked um meanwhile they're out still playing and this guy gets banned because he says some nasty shit like I said, I'm not trying to say that he shouldn't have been but the fact that people are able to go ahead and do all this stuff and there's really no way uh, like I said, I could be wrong. I don't know how this system works. I don't know if there's a way for Riot to go back and replay a game or something. And, um, excuse me, go replay a game and see what actually led up to the point of somebody starting to rage and, you know, cuss out somebody or whatever. But it's just, I see that it's unfair that somebody will go ahead and get disciplined because they finally reached their breaking point and they said something that they normally wouldn't. And like I said, the, the troll or whoever the feeder gets to go ahead and walk free and continue to go ahead and troll and just do whatever the hell they want. And it's just really sad that, you know, Riot isn't doing anything to fix this at all. And, you know, the only reason I'm making this is because, you know, I was watching this video and I kind of felt like I, I felt like I could relate to him because there have been plenty of times, you know, when I'm playing ranked that um you know i would just get pissed off because it's like the system the system is so unfair you get into a game and you you know you may be like i mentioned this in my other video you may be lucky enough to get some people that actually want to win the game you and and you know 
the rest of the people are, are going to be trash. <laughs> and, you know, I, I don't mean just like, you know, they, they could, they could, how do I, how do I word that? I don't want to say trash, but, you know, they, supposedly everyone that you get paired up with is on your same skill level, right? But you don't have any control over what the person's going to do, if they're going to troll or feed or whatever. So, you're kind of at the mercy of your other teammates. And the way, the only reason, the only way you're going to go ahead and get a ranked game where you know everyone's going to go ahead and cooperate with you is if you do ranked teams. If you and four other people get together that you know you do ranked team. Otherwise, you're either going to be stuck in solo queue or duo queue. And that way you're going to go ahead and, and end up with two, not two, but um three or four other random people that you have ne- probably never met ever in your life and never played with. And you don't know what they're going to do. So... Oh, excuse me. It's just I kind of I kind of understand his frustration because, you know, you go ahead and you get paired up with somebody that just doesn't give a shit. They go ahead and do whatever the fuck they want. They feed. They just do stupid stuff. And you're building up all this anger. This is why, like, I told myself I was going to take a break from rank a little bit because I feel I felt like at one point I wanted to stop playing league. Um, and you know, a couple of times I did take break. I did take breaks from league, but I didn't want to just completely stop. But you know, sometimes I feel like, you know, why am I wasting my time on this game when, you know, I feel like I keep getting screwed over by, you know, stupid people that don't, that just don't give a shit about, you know, what happens to me as far as whether I get demoted or not. So I wish they had a system where it's like, you know, okay, you go ahead and ban people because of toxic behavior. You know, that's cool and all, but you do realize, right, that some people's toxic behavior does not necessarily have to be typed up. People can be toxic by feeding. People can be toxic by not communicating with the team and cooperating and, you know, trying to get something going. There are other ways to be toxic besides just writing up an insulting comment and you know whatever so they need to implement a system where it's like freaking punish these people who are trolling punish these people who are feeding on purpose punish the people who are afk and just walking around in base so they don't get kicked out of the game for being afk you know the shit like that i don't i don't want to be banned because i decided to to take all my frustration out on somebody who actually deserves to be punished so in a way i go ahead and get punished because i said something offensive but then the guy that pissed me off gets to walk away free. That's not fair. Like I said, there's a there, there's a a point where you know people can only take so much. So, you know, I just wanted to do this quick video. I don't know. It, it's just I don't know how other people feel about it. You know, I'm not saying that he didn't deserve the ban. You know, I don't know how many reports of being toxic he got, but it's just the fact that I kind of feel what he's going through of. You know, I, how can you have fun with a game and you keep getting paired up with people who don't give a shit? They just, their way of having fun is ruining your day. So how can you expect to have fun when you're constantly getting paired up with these people? But, you know, I'm just hoping Riot will just freaking listen to the community. It's like this, this community it's like you got some of the people who really enjoy this game. Like, I really want to play this game. I want to move up. I want to, you know, get into gold or platinum. You know what? I just want to get, you know, higher up. But I can't do that because I keep getting placed with people who freaking get, get like, they, they enjoy just ruining other people's day by just going and doing stupid shit. So, you know, riot, please. <laughs> Freaking do something because, you know, you're a huge company. You're a free-to-play game, but people are spending hundreds, if not thousands of dollars on this extra stuff. Freaking skins and ward skins and, and, and buying champs instead of, you know, going and, and gaining um, IP. They buy RP to gain, you know, all this other stuff. It's like you're getting the money. I don't know how many people play League, but they have the money to go ahead and implement some sort of system. Like I was watching one of Sky's videos. He said, you know, they could go ahead and and 
um, depending on like if you know they get an in-game reporting system they can go ahead and implement something where if a person gets reported enough they can send one of Riot's um, guys to come in and spectate the game and watch how everything is played out to see if this person's continued to be toxic or just go back and see what led up to this point where they got reported things like that they have the money to do this you know they just don't want to for whatever reason but I'm done hopefully riot you can get your shit together because this freaking game people are leaving people are getting fed up it's not fun when you get paired up with people who don't give a shit they only thing they do they freaking get off by ruining your day but that's it I'm done I hope y'all got something from this hopefully Riot, somebody knows some somebody from Riot, they can go ahead and share this shit and have Riot go and fix something. I don't know. This stuff pisses me off because I really do enjoy this game and I just don't want it to be ruined by stupid people who just want to go ahead and troll and act stupid, but I'm done. Alright.